This is the weather briefing for the week of March 3rd through March 7th. This is Robert Moyeda, and I'm a meteorologist with the National Weather Service in Miami, serving all of South Florida. Here are the weather highlights for this week. The nice and mild weather we had over the weekend is expected to continue at least into midweek. However, by Thursday, we do expect changes as a cold front moves across our area and that will trigger showers and thunderstorms with the potential for, for some of these storms to produce strong and gusty winds. Following the front late on Thursday, we do expect clearing and cooler weather to end the week. First, let's take a look at the first part of the week, or Tuesday and Wednesday. We expect, aside from some late night and early morning fog over the interior and Gulf Coast sections, we expect skies to be mostly sunny. Temperatures will reach the lower to even mid-80s during the afternoon hours on both Tuesday and Wednesday, with late night and early morning lows in the 50s and 60s. With the fog expected to form over the interior and Gulf Coast sections, Motorists are advised to use extra caution, especially if traveling across these areas. The, inc the increase in moisture for Wednesday will lead to low rain chances. However, for the most part, it will be mostly sunny and mostly dry both Tuesday and Wednesday. As we get to Thursday, however, things will change as a low pressure area will form over the Gulf of Mexico. This low will then move across North Florida and drag a cold front down the state. Ahead of the cold front, a surge of tropical moisture from the Caribbean Sea will move northward across the area, and this will trigger a good chance of showers and thunderstorms. Right now, there is the potential for some of these storms to produce strong and gusty winds, and we will continue to evaluate the threat of, the, of strong winds with these storms as the week progresses. Therefore, we recommend that you stay abreast of the latest weather information, especially as we get closer to Thursday. The front is expected to move through South Florida late in the day or on Thursday night. Following the front, drier air will move in from the north, and this will make way for a breezy and cooler day on Friday, with lows in the 50s and 60s, and highs on Friday reaching only the 70s. Thank you very much for viewing this weather briefing. For the latest forecasts, watches, and warnings, please visit our webpage at weather.gov forward slash South Florida, and you can also find us on social media, on Facebook, and on Twitter.